Absolutely, Tier. You know, I'm I'm seeing that uh, every day, and I think think practice is just you know a whole bunch of what helps make a successful actuary. You know, and it actually kind of leads into something that I was curious about. You know, especially given that you you know recently attained your designation, is there anything you might have to tell us about uh, exams? I know that that's a really big part of. Um, you know, starting, it's a big black box, especially when, when you're just beginning your, your journey. Well, the first and most important thing, I think, is just hitting the study hours target. So I think the general rule is 100 hours of studying for each hour of exam time. So plan a study schedule, build in time for delays, and really make studying a priority. You know, there are no secrets, there are no shortcuts, there are no strategies that are going to substitute for putting in enough time. And if you fail an exam, you know, don't underestimate the amount of time you need on the second attempt. Uh, you know, if you're memorizing for an FSA exam, you have to rememorize everything. And you have to get to a point where you recognize types of problems and subjects immediately and where you can get through the problems really quickly. And to get there, you have to have recently reviewed and practiced. And, you know, now that I'm done with my exams, I would just tell anybody who's still taking them that, you know, the end is not that far away. It's definitely not as far away as you think. And making the sacrifice now is worth it. And when you're making progress, it doesn't feel so long. I like that a lot. So do you like remember distinct times when, you know, you were just going and things just clicked or, you know, like you got in those hours? Like, did you, does it just feel different when you're able to do, put in the, requ the recommended hours versus, you know, take an exam when you've had significantly less? Yeah, I mean, I learned by trial and error. And I think a lot of people learn that way. Um, but anybody who's succeeded that you talk to that you know at work or through your friends, they'll tell you that they focused and they put in a ton of time. And, you know, that's really what you need to do to get through it. Hey, pro socialites, are you interested in or thinking about becoming an actuary? Do you have questions about what an actuary actually does or how best to prepare for exams? Are you looking to be part of a community of successful actuaries and actuarial students sharing their lessons learned to help one another succeed in the profession? Well then come be a part of the Pro Social Learning community. Visit PSLJourney.com and find interviews, webinars, blog posts, online courses, and everything else that we can provide all geared to help you succeed as an actuary. Definitely let us know if you have any questions or if you're interested in sharing your journey on pro social learning. Just go to psljourney.com slash questions or send an email to questions at psljourney.com. Are you ready to embark on a journey? Let's do this.